uh, benevolent, right? And they really wanted us to work. Uh, the problem is, I, I realized without knowing it that we were in a system that was not trustless. <laughs> that you had operators you could trust, operators you could not trust. The result was that a lot of the investors that had brought on board and partners lost their shirt on it, right? And um, at the end of it, I was going to exit the industry uh, on that basis uh, because I just said, okay, I don't see where um, I'm going to fit into this. And this is actually where I met one of the early editors of Bitcoin magazine at the time. So you, you're thinking 2015, right? Uh, <laughs> right after Mongox, right after Silk Road being closed, uh, Bitcoin had just gone down to what was that? Uh, between 300 or 200 and 500 bucks, right? And and this is this is pretty much when I entered it. It, it was not for speculation around Bitcoin. It was not because I thought it was a great asset class, like Michael 